we have a report here, school information. Here, the records are sorted by surname. The records are not grouped by school. We want to group the records by school. Let me close the report. I'm going to make a copy of this report. Right click copy, right click paste. I'm going to call the new report School Information Grouped. I'm going to open the report. I'm going to go into Design View in order to group the records. Now here, I have the tools that I need for the grouping. If these tools are not visible, on the ribbon, select the Design tab, and in the group, Grouping and Totals, select Group and Sort. Let me, there it is. Right, now, I want to add a group. I want to group all these records by school. Yeah, we have the area where we're going to do our grouping. That needs to be dragged to there. And this made smaller. That column heading should be here at the beginning now, above the school. I'm going to pick it up and put it there for the moment. These boxes I'm going to move to the right. That column heading is now going to go there. These two should be aligned on the left. The range line to the left. But I've got a problem here. The most important thing here, the thing at the top, sort by surname, and then sort by name, and lastly, group on school. No, no, no. This should be at the beginning, at the top. I'm going to just click there, select it, and move it up. It must be above surname. There we are. The most important thing is grouping on school. And then within each school, sorting by surname and then by name. Let's have a look. Okay. There we are. School, Brooklyn. School down. Glenwood. And then the last school. And notice how within a school, the records are sorted in alphabetical order. Good. In this report, we now have the records grouped by school.